In this video, we'll look at whether Mg is more reactive than Fe. So comparing magnesium and iron, which one reacts more vigorously? As we look at this periodic table, we see this general trend. As we go this way towards the left, metals become more reactive. As we go down, they become more reactive as well. So this is a very reactive area of the periodic table. Nonmetals, kind of the opposite trend. In noble gases, they don't react at all. So let's find iron here, right here is iron and magnesium is an alkaline earth metal. So looking at their placement on the periodic table, the magnesium is really kind of closer to this more reactive area than the iron. And in general, alkaline earth metals, they're more reactive than the transition metals. So this is a general trend, but we would expect magnesium to be more reactive than iron. We could also look at what's called the activity series, and this is something you probably do a lot in school. So the activity series, you usually use that when you're looking at single displacement reactions. So let's just find magnesium and iron. And we can see magnesium closer to the top, so it's more reactive than the iron that's going to be less reactive. So according to the activity series, magnesium is a more reactive metal than iron, and that's what we saw on the periodic table. There's one last way we could do this. We could just get some magnesium metal and some iron metal and put it in hydrochloric acid and see what happens, see which one reacts more vigorously. We would expect that magnesium would react more vigorously, maybe produce more bubbles or dissolve quicker. This is Dr. B talking about the reactivity of magnesium and iron. Thanks for watching.